Hey guys, the objective for this video is to use dynamic similarity to determine percentage increase in speed. So our question here, we've got a Boeing 747 weighing 263,000 kilograms and it's carrying 100 passengers and its takeoff speed is 225 kilometers per hour. With the same configuration, what is the takeoff speed of a plane with 372 passengers and we assume that the passenger weight is 90 kilograms. So we know um, for steady flight, our lift force has to be equal to our weight force. So that means that lift, which is equal to our lift coefficient multiplied by our half times our density times by our velocity squared times by our area is gonna be equal to our weight force. Um, so what we know um, so far is that the area isn't gonna change. So the area with 100 passengers is it going to be the same as the area with 372 passengers? We're still going to have the same wing size. Um, our density with 100 passengers is going to be the same as our density with 372 passengers. Um, and we also know um, that our lift coefficient with 100 passengers is going to be the same as our lift coefficient with 372 passengers. So what that means is using dynamic similarity that um, our, our lift force for 100 passengers divided by our lift force uh, for 372 passengers uh, is going to be